This movie, American Ultra, is coming out with Jesse Eisenberg. Jesse's character is an everyday stoner who, unbeknownst to him, is actually a sleeper agent that gets activated while working a shift at a convenience store. Jerry Progressive, listen. Mandelbrot set is in motion. Echo Choir has been breached. I didn't choose the challenge life. The challenge life chose me and as Complex's resident dare taker, I was challenged to, just like Jesse's character, work a shift at a convenience store while stoned. There are four basic traits every sleeper agent must possess. Agility, you have to move quickly, you have to move gracefully. Speed, you gotta be fast, you gotta know your opponent's next move. Must be observant, never take your eyes off the prize. And then you have to be stealthy, glide undetected and pounce at the right moment. Hi, Sean, I'm the newbie, I'm here to, I'm here to for my first day. This is Ruba, the fiery owner of the Smelly Deli. Have I you need ever a crash course. In a in a convenience store? Never worked in a convenience store in my life. I don't think that she's cleared the idea of me being high as hell the whole time, but we're in Boulder, Colorado. I'm gonna leave you to it. Make sure that this list is done before you leave, sweep the floors, and I think you're good to go. All right, amazing. All I'm right. gonna go take a break and then uh, it's, it's here for the night. And by break, I mean smoke a joint by the dumpsters out back. So the first one, I'm gonna go with the uh, Tangerine Sunrise. It's a sativa. I hope it keeps me up. I'm still not used to it being legal here. I feel Sketchy as fuck out. There are two schools of smokers. There are people like Rihanna who can get blasted out of their skull and then just sit courtside at an NBA All-Star game. And then there are people like me who can't even walk through a CVS without having a complete panic attack. I'm really living a fucking nightmare right now. Ah, it didn't go through. It says for me to call the police. But actually? Yeah. Really? Okay. <laughs> Messing with these stone college kids, so easy. Do you mean, uh, newspapers? Newspapers. I don't think so, no. You could just use the internet now. How's it going, man? Can I interest you in a cowtail? Cowtail for you, or are you going to pass as well? It's not a cowtail. It's not an actual cowtail. Cowtail as well on that, or just the Coke? Oh, yeah, throw me one of those. All things. right, there you go. You have to. It's time to pack a bowl with the uh, Gandalf pipe. There are tons of workers who get through their shifts high. So here I am patting myself on the back for working one convenience store shift, blasted out of my gourd. I feel a little weird celebrating myself for that. I was wondering if I could get some of the Swisher sweets. Sure. I was high as fuck that whole time, but I'm not stupid. So I knew that during the shift that they would throw curveballs at me. Which one do you like, the, the, this one? Up I can here. see a plant this one? coming from a mile away. You know, these people, they got me with the oldest trick in the book and it was the first one that they threw. That one I can live with because she comes up and she's telling me to keep looking. I'm confused. That guy takes off Yo. with two pieces of candy and for whatever reason, one protein bar. That's such a psychopath move to go with the fruit candy yeah. and then the almond Snickers so and then like the, the pre-workout protein bar. Good, good, how are you? Good, um, can I also get a pack of the um, sweet green Dutch masses? Is it me, or is the entire town of Boulder blazed? Yeah, I kind of remember you all having Zot's candies. Yeah, it looks like they want to just give it to me for free, I guess. It's the goldfish? Yep. <laughs> yeah, you got the munchies, huh? Oh, yeah. What you smoking, what's your strand? It's a sativa, so it's definitely an upper. Keep you up? Yeah, exactly. I like that kid, just high as shit, just coming in to get his goldfish and then he's out. This is now the third time I've smoked, and it's not just your garden variety grass. Like, this is military grade boulder stuff. At this point, I can't deal with the public anymore. I'm a liability. I'm just gonna start focusing on the other more secret agent type job responsibilities. You always keep that last one right on the edge for display. Good lord. I don't want to fuck up your floors or anything, bro. No, no, no. I think we're good. All right. Please don't fall yeah. on your face. Yep. Okay. Oh, one of those? Be careful. <sighs> Say, man, I fucking... Do I know you from somewhere? It might have been uh, Jason Statham. You bored? What? You bored? Right now? No, like, snowboard. Oh. No, no. Like, no, I haven't oh, seen you. What? Carving it, no. Fire. You want a cowtail? Cowtail? Yeah. 
Oh, shit. Uh, what are... It's a caramel treat with a gooey center. I don't anything with a cow in it. That's it's not, like, it doesn't, it has, it's not like beef. I'm gonna go ahead and pass on the cow Okay, all right. You seem like cool dudes. You smoke weed? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You smoke weed or what? Yeah. I got a pretty hefty blunt. You wanna get down? All right, so I'm walking back to smoke with this guy. I thought that he was, you know, when I took this challenge, I knew that production would throw curveballs at me left and right. And this guy, I thought he was just some curveball because he was such a character. As it turns out, this guy is 100% legit, not a curveball. <laughs> All right, so I'm Sean. How's it going? I'm Sean. I uh, am an internet person. What's up? And. Uh, so when I took this like this thing, this challenge, I knew that they'd throw curveballs at me. You well, know what you're I mean? A challenge? So when you walked in and saw that spill and were like, "Ugh, I need some snacks." That's just you. Dude, I was starved. <laughs> what if you could have any job in the world? What would it be? Any job in the world? An astronaut? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, fuck, uh, fucking space. Yeah, yeah. Look at this bitch. I made some mistakes. I wasn't perfect, but. For a guy who smoked three joints, one Gandalf hit, and split a blunt with that crazy boulder local, I think I did pretty good. Honestly, if, I, if it was my Tell first day for, for real, like whatever, would you bring me back? I was a little skeptical when you came in first. Yes. You know, as the day got on, I feel like you were getting a little higher every time you took a break. Right. But for being high, I honestly can say you did a better job than most of my people. So at the end of the day, can I smoke a ton of weed, work a shift at the counter, sling a couple cowtails on the side, and be a sleeper agent? Yes. Jake, what's happening? I have to go to work.